I don't know how well you can see this, but we're on top of the 1899 Seneca Falls fire engine. Steam driven, of course. This is the tube sheet of the boiler, <clears throat> but what I wanted to show you was a variable geometry exhaust nozzle. You can see there are four jets which each have plunging cones inside of them which are raised and lowered by this yoke in the center. And what I'm doing to control that is operating a screw on the side. This is a feature that French locomotives had and a lot of other steam engines that exhausted up their chimneys, but not so much in America. Only fire engines in America typically had this. And the way it operates is it's a draft controller. The exhaust steam coming out of the steam engine, if you're working it hard, is basically always the same amount of steam. However, if you have a lot of steam in the boiler and you don't want your safety valve lifting, you want to reduce the effectiveness of the draft. With the cones up and all the way out like this, there is very little back pressure coming out of the engine. And even though they're open wide, the low back pressure creates low steam velocity. So it does not entrain the fire gases through the tubes as fast. When you begin to plunge the cones inside, the back pressure increases. The engine will slow down a bit because of that, but the steam velocity up the jets and up the chimney will be much more uh, vigorous. So the fire will be drafted much stronger. So if you want to gain on the steam pressure, if it's low, you put the cones down like that. It's a great little feature. Nord locomotives in France had this. A lot of other things in Europe had this. Uh, our railway locomotives would have benefited from it, but unfortunately we didn't really do any of that. So I just figured I would show you a little esoteric feature normally only found on fire engines in America. And we're here at Steve Heaver's museum, the Fire Museum of Maryland in the dark. And I'm using a crude little cell phone flashlight, but I figured you should see that.